Is Bitcoin maybe the best financial investment? Maybe. So you want to know everything about that and also how Ethereum is in the $3,000 K. Bitcoin now in the $53,000 and much more. Smash the like button. It's time for crypto news. Rodrigo Arnido, crypto to the max. Today, we're going to tell you everything about the crypto world once more. But first things first. Let's celebrate that we just changed our image out there. We have it in X, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, you name it. Of course, YouTube. We have Crypto News with Rodrigo Arnedo and now with this astronaut. And why is that? Well, because we need this suit in order to go to the moon as the crypto world is going out there. Tell me in the comments below if you like it or not. How do you like our English channel Crypto News? And also, how do you like our AI channel out there? Links in the description below. Of course, our website now with the astronaut and you have this snip feed so you can follow us in every place we are at almost everywhere fun on the right crypto news of course now more crypto news than ever and here it's new that ethereum broke the three thousand dollar line but we are going down today this is not good you can see here the last times we were there this is rodrigo arnedo and the crazy charts with trading view link in the description below and you can see how we broke it here and here and also we attempted here uh, to break it. So if we go to my crazy charts and we create the comparison between all those charts, you can see we are doing different things as we did here in the daily chart. Uh, when we broke, we broke for good. Here we broke for good too. And uh, yesterday we didn't. So now we are considering the possibility, the bad possibility of Ethereum being uh, in a similar situation as we had here. So if that's the case, those are not good news because with the ghost pattern in the candles, you can see that we are going to go down. Down to 2,444, we'll see about that. And then up again, and we will be at 3,500 for March the 24th. But on February the 26th, uh, we will be in this uh, bottom uh, higher, uh, lower low of 2,442. So we'll see about that. Thing is that Vitalik Buterin asked for Ethereum in 3K and we had it. Well, this is AI fake, of course, as they created that one. ADA Cardano is better than the ETFs. Well, if you like Cardano, come with us to validate in Fanon. Fanon the right. If you have some others out there, put your money into work we just validated the number 128 block in our fanon pool and vitalik is happy because of those uh, vertical trees so you can see that ethereum no matter if we go beyond 3000 or not keeps on developing and we are so happy because of that and bitcoin wanted to eclipse uh, this news because it went all the way to $53,000, a new high. We are so happy. But even though we went to that line as Ethereum did, we are now going down. And maybe we still find support in this line I just draw, but we are breaking this bullish triangle. What do you think about that? What do you think is going to happen? Any case, the ETFs out there keep on releasing some advertisements. And Eric Balchunas, the expert in this, is crazy. He doesn't understand because we had with HODL, with this ticker, with this ETF, a 14x jump in average volume. And why is that? It seems it's not one institution, but like 32,000 operations. So is this retail? Is this a TikToker out there recommending the ETFs? Maybe so. I consider maybe. This is because the ETF uh, is listed in an exchange, like for example, CoinW, but I went there and it's not the case. Any case, as we are talking about our partner, CoinW, you have the link in the description below and you can buy their ETFs and cryptocurrencies, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and many more. Monero, for example, now that you can't buy it on other exchanges. So link in the description below, you have some advantages because you are a rider here from Crypto News with Rodrigo Arnido. 
Also, CoinW, follow them on X Twitter. They uh, gave us this uh, historical price action chart for past Bitcoin halvings that I love. So pause the video and uh, do your uh, diligence because with uh, using this chart. Also, Eric Crown telling us that this is the closest to its prior all-time high. Bitcoin has been pre-halving than ever before by a decent margin. So you can see we are just 29% to the all-time high. And we were before 70%, 68%, and 64%. So that's a huge difference. What do you think about that? Maybe, as the Bitcoin therapist is telling us here, you will blink and you'll be in the $1,000 line. Maybe so. Hopefully so. Here, Tobiani telling us that those ETFs are absorbing a lot of money every day. Great scale, little by little, out of Bitcoin. We'll see about that. And also from the Chicago Mercantile Exchange, uh, they are planning to launch micro euro denominated Bitcoin futures on March 18th, pending regulatory approval. So we keep on developing and adopting just like in Argentina. Millet telling us that the Argentine government in January saw its first monthly budget surplus in nearly 12 years. So congratulations to Argentinians followers. Also Salvador uh, is asked, what do you prefer to borrow money for the FMI or having your Bitcoin as a legal tender? And they say, we don't care about that money, that it's good for the country, of course, but FMI will not give us that money because they want to control us. They want us to get rid of Bitcoin. And we are not going to do that. So once more, congratulations to Najib Bukele and all Salvadorians out there. And the thing is, that Michael Saylor again is telling us this is the most important asset out there. Let's listen to his point of view. It is the, the uh, strongest asset. So what we see right now is that Bitcoin has just emerged as a trillion dollar asset class. And it's alongside uh, names like Apple and Google and Microsoft. But the difference between Bitcoin and the Magnificent Seven is Bitcoin's an asset class. It's not a company. There's not a lot, enough room in the capital structure of those companies to hold 10 trillion or 100 trillion dollars worth of capital. So Bitcoin's competing against gold, which is 10x what it is right now. It's competing against the S&P index. It's competing against real estate, a hundred trillion dollar plus asset class as a store of value. So we believe capital is going to keep flowing from those asset classes into Bitcoin because Bitcoin is technically superior to those asset classes. And that, that being the case, there's just no reason to sell the winner to buy the losers. <laughs> There's no reason selling the winner for buying the loser. I believe that's the case, of course. Really interesting, Michael Saylor. Thank you very much. Remember, he told us if you bought a flat in Manhattan, New York, you wouldn't get rid of it because there's not so many of those and you can rent it. So maybe in the future, we don't have to sell our Bitcoin, just rent it. That would be awesome, of course. Maybe we have in the chart an invest head and shoulders. That's Max's opinion. And maybe we'll close this month in the green. And this will be six months in a row. Here, Bitcoin are type telling us this. But I don't agree with these seven month scandals because we had our own chart, remember? And uh, the more we see, the most uh, impressive bull runs are six uh, candles. So maybe we are again in a six candle. Remember, I believe we are doing something similar to this. What's your opinion? I'm not expert. This is not financial advice. We just kept on learning and uh, we learned yesterday about RSI in the weekly. And today we're going to go deeper into the monthly. So you can see we are breaking almost the 70 line in the monthly too. And the last times we did that were here, 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 and here. And what happened? One, two, three, four times. That means good. Up, 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 and up. And two times. That meant uh, low, uh, lower for some period of time. So what do you think is going to happen right now? We're going to go up or we're going to find their resistance and we will go down for a little bit. Remember my crazy chart about the parallel I told you yesterday. The stock market went up yesterday, which is good. And dollar is going down, which is good too. 
so nice, but now the market is in the red. We still need some red days out there. Of course, the most important ones, well, we have some red and some green out there. Uh, this STRK is uh, down, it went up like crazy, and then down is what is listed in this exchange. But then community is not happy because they say they release uh, so many supply and they were tricked, etc., etc. If you want to learn about this controversy, links in the description below to this article and also to this one. What is this Stark Net? This is a layer to roll up one of those solutions. Maybe the one we need, maybe not. I'm out of this project, but what about you? Do you think this is interesting? In any case, consider this piece of advice from Jacob Canfield, telling us that you need to remind that almost every altcoin you're holding in your portfolio will probably look like this chart in 24, 26 months. So it will go up and then down for good. This happened to me in 2016 and 17 with almost all of my cryptos. Dragon Chain, you remember those pools, etc.? Well, crazy, crazy projects. And yes, this time I'm going to try and have some benefits in our way out, especially with altcoins. Maybe not with Ethereum and Bitcoin, but with these crazy altcoins, maybe I'm out of them in the near future. Good things for Metamax integrating uh, safety alarms uh, in Pews, but this company, that's good that uh, it's improving. But if you want to be safe, you need Dextools.io. Link in the description below. They will tell you everything about Stark. They will tell you everything about Pandora, about Beam, Troll, all the ones, all the hot pairs out there. So again, links in the description below. And we need it, especially because we are in the extreme grid and we need extra information at this time. Like, for example, did you go to your Firefly Wyatt uh, recently? I was yesterday there and I found this scam you told me about. Uh, allegedly, I won 2,000 IOTA. This is a scam. Be careful out there. This is an NTF. It's there. If they will steal everything from you. So I burned it and uh, this is not legit. So be careful out there. Also, maybe travel from China. The biggest signals from Reuters that China is slashing mortgages reference rates to revive property market. So is this good? Is the printer going to burp again for the good or for the financial crisis of the world? I don't know, but I need a good piece of information. So here you have it. Swiss Post Office to launch Bitcoin trading and custody service tomorrow. Post Finance has 2.5 million customers and is the fifth biggest bank in Switzerland. Good news for Bitcoin. And now for the cat section. Today we learned we shouldn't drink alcohol at least. This cat will not allow us to do so. Do not drink. I told you, you're not drinking beer anymore. If you want to control your alcohol intake, I recommend you this book I love. You have it on Audible. I listened to it, but I also bought a physical copy. So I'm going to leave you both the audiobook and the link in the description below because I believe that we don't understand that we live in an alcoholic society all over the world. I'm just watching How I Meet Your Mother and they are all the time drinking, just all the time. I want to watch Friends again because they weren't drinking all the time. If you want to learn about Audible, it's free. So use it for free and you help us a lot. You have the link in the description below. So do that for us at least. Or buy the book with our link. It comes some centimes, uh, some pennies if you use this link. If you use Audible, uh, it comes like, I don't know, like five years or something like that. So thank you very much for that so that we can keep on researching for crazy cats like this one. It just can't uh, wait for Bitcoin to go to the 100 k okay. Really nice. Just keep calm out there like this guy. Remember, we want love. We want to be calm out there. We do need a Lamborghini whatsoever just this state of mind so we are free and we are enjoying our time in this planet free to run and having some friends out there and also playing playing like this cat is doing having fun be careful that you might drop you might fall if so 
any case, let's play or let's keep on learning. Of course, artificial intelligence, some things that you know, I will tell you about them in EIAI News with Rodrigo Renido. If you want more for crypto, well, you have these two videos in Crypto News, Rodrigo Renido, Health, Money, Love, Party in Peace, and the best is yet to come. To the moon!